Okay. Look, I hate to ask this, but... Are we there yet? <laughs> We're not far. Look, Sarah, you can get through this. We both will. But I'm not okay. Just try. Can you do that? She just needs a little time, Clem. Leave her be for a bit. I don't know about this. The way she is, she's gonna cause problems. What happened in there? When we went in there, you were ready to help, but then something changed. Look, I just... I'd seen that kind of thing before. I just didn't want to stick around for the bitter end. Sorry, I... I don't mean to sound harsh. It's just the way things are. You really weren't helping things back there. I thought I could count on you. And just because you got her out of there today, doesn't mean you saved her. Trust me. I tried to save Jamie, too, but she gave up. I just... I can't believe it. As soon as you guys said go, I was the first one up on the roof. Like I had already made up my mind. Luke, you can't let it eat away at you. Well, I can't forget it. I dragged my sister across four states. And every morning, she'd say she wasn't getting up. So I'd convince her, or push her, or goddamn carry her if I had to. Until this time, walkers cornered us, forced us up to the roof. And, and when they kept coming, I, I couldn't make her jump, couldn't throw her. So I tried something else. I told her she could have what she wanted, and I left her there. Jumped to the next building over by myself. Jane, I'm really sorry. It killed me for a long time. But I finally realized that I'd put her on a forced march through hell, when all she really wanted was for me to let her go. Sarah was that way too. Jane? No regard for her own safety. Or ours. Sarah isn't dangerous. She's gonna be okay. Fine. Just be careful. Come on. Let's get back to your friends. Son of a bitch. You found him? Yeah, I'm a little amazed myself, to tell you the truth. If it weren't for Clem and Jane, well, I don't know what would have happened. Sarah, how you doing, hon? That's okay, sweetie. Whenever you're ready, I'm just glad you're here. Wait, wait. Where's Nick? I'm Rebecca. How about we, uh, we go for a walk for a minute? Let's just give him some space. I have something I need to talk to you about, too. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> I ain't gonna sugarcoat this. That baby's coming even faster than Rebecca's letting on. But I was hoping you might know, does Luke know anything about babies? Has he, I don't know, mentioned Carlos teaching him anything? Kenny had a family. He could help. Where is he? He... Brought Sarita in there not long after you left. I don't know if he's done it yet. I ain't seen him since. I don't think he's doing well. <sighs> I'll go in there. 
Thank you, Clem. I really do think that might be best. We need your help, with Rebecca's baby. No one else knows what to do. She didn't want me to wait, but I had to. In case by some crazy chance, she didn't come back. Sarita was a good person. I liked her. You know what it feels like to get beaten. Almost to death. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Duck. Katja. Sarita. No peace. No rest. Kenny, you're not... you're not dead. We need you. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because I've done so great with everything else in my goddamn life. Why the hell couldn't Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That baby's almost here, and Rebecca needs your help. Yeah, I guess she does. Nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. Don't be stupid. It could be infected. Well? Oh, shit. Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? Well, we should see what's going on. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. Mm. Oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. That means the baby's coming, right? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca trap her like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. This place doesn't seem safe for a baby being born. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. The museum seems like it could be a good start. I'll go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny. You, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah? You just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem... I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mac a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking... How do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I trust Jane. Yeah. I mean, I would have never made it back without her. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfectant. I'll go with Mike and Bonnie. All right. Well, let's get going. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast, and let's be careful. I 
I guess that's the place there. Fuck. It's a wreck. You ain't even been inside yet. Just look at it. Glass all blown out, walkers hanging around. Maybe we can still find something. Yeah, maybe. Sorry. I just really want sticking with y'all to work out. And it's been hard so far. How about you make it up to us by helping out with those walkers up there? Yeah, all right. Jane showed me a good way to attack them. If you take out a knee, they always fall. And then you can stab them in the back of the neck. Hmm. A good smack to the head's always done fine for me. down the leg. Yeah, okay. Let's do this before more of them show up. Watch out for the broken glass. It's all over. Okay. Somebody's already been through here. Guess that's not a surprise. Still, might be something worthwhile left. Let's check it out. Not in a while, though. Let's just make a sweep. I really don't want to go back empty-handed. Keep one eye on the woods while we're in here. I don't want nothing sneaking up on us. I watch this. Souvenirs, huh? Looking for a keychain with your name on it? No. Why would I want a keychain? I don't even have any keys. Ah, oh, good point. Do you think these work? Nah, they're just for show. Be handy, though. Also, really loud. Good point. You think maybe they say that stuff about water and blankets just to get people? Hey, look at this. An old coat. Nice. Good find, Clem. You should hang on to that. It's gonna get a lot colder before it starts getting warmer. Maybe I could give it to Rebecca. That's a good idea. I'm sure she'll really appreciate it. I guess you've already got that old coat I gave you. I feel so bad about everything that happened. Hopefully you won't always think of me like that. Not that I blame you if you did. I haven't always used the best judgment. It seems like you're with us now. That's what matters most. Clem found a jacket. That's great, but, uh, isn't Gray the, you know, uh... We can't put Rebecca in a confederate coat. Oh, I didn't even think about that. Guess it's better than nothing, though. Do you see anything good? Not so far, but let's give the place a good going over. Lee would have loved this place. There have sure been some animals through here. Watch where you step. Any luck? No, not so much. Unless you want some broken glass. Over here. Water. Bottled and clean. That's just what we need. It's locked. You want to kick it down? That'd make an awful lot of noise. Yeah, maybe. You know, if somebody was small enough, they could maybe squeeze through that gap there. I could try to pry it open some more, but I don't know if that'll help much. No, I mean, maybe... Are you sure you can't get it open? Okay, no, that's all right. Maybe I can just reach through to the lock. Ah! 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 
Lady! Jesus Christ! Something's got Hold me! Hold back before a biker! Help me, please! He's coming! Hold on! Well, that happened. You okay, Bonnie? It's just a bump. I'm gonna be all right. I should have tried to crawl through. I might have spotted him better. It's all right. I, I shouldn't have asked anyway. Let me see your arm. No, I... I didn't get bit, just old scars. At least now we got something to bring back. I'll keep checking the other room. Let's get this water. <laughs> hey, I got this. That looks pretty heavy. Uh, it's all right. I know it looks like a lot, but we could all go through this pretty quick. Carver was crazy, but at least his shells were always full. You're right. I thought it looked like so much. That baby's gonna be hard on everyone, especially Rebecca. And between you and me, she's not looking too good. Hey, guys! Come on, stick close. I just walked on in like it owned the place. Figure it'd make a nice meal. We can eat raccoon? I'd eat the shit out of that raccoon. Not like, I mean, just, just that I'd be really happy to eat that raccoon. I'm starving. Fresh meat would go a long way with Rebecca. Yeah. Shoot! Don't let it get away! Over here! Fast. Shit! Dang it! <laughs> Not with the walkers out there. I'm even hungrier than I was before. How'd I get to a place where I'm sad I'm not eating raccoon? Well... I'm sort of glad it got away. It had a family. Yeah, me too. Come on, let's just get this back to Rebecca and the others. We don't have much time to waste. I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. How long did your son take? How you doing, Beck? Okay. I'm okay. How did you guys make Museum's out? Museum's a bust. All glass walls shattered. It'd be impossible. And it was picked over pretty good. Lots of folks probably been there before us. We found some water, though. Oh, that's good. Nice work. Good. Good. We save all of that for Rebecca. Anybody else gets a thirst, you can go to the river. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Alvin would be really proud of you right now. You think so? I hope you're right. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's gonna be a girl. 
Oh, yeah? That big dummy never did have a sense for these things. I've got a feeling this one's a boy. You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Ah, oh shit. I got this. I'm worried that we ain't seen Jane in a while. Go check on her, would you? Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Are you okay, Kenny? Sure. Why wouldn't I be? job finding those bottles of water. That's a good score. We couldn't have brought them back without Mike. Yeah, he's, uh, he's pretty strong, that's for sure. He thinks we don't like him. No, it's not that. I just think he's more eager than he has a right to be. Okay, he wants acceptance before he's earned it. Does that make sense to you? I guess so. What are you thinking about? I'm worried about Rebecca. Having a baby can be rough enough on a woman, even in a nice, clean hospital. Does she even have a shot out here? That walk seemed longer to you on the way back. No, but thanks for carrying the water. I didn't realize how tired I was until I put it down. I need to rest up a bit. Seems like folks appreciated it, though. But that's good. Maybe they'll come around after all. I hope one of these buildings is safer than out here. This looks like where we are right now. I hope Jane finds something good over there. Hey, Sarah. You know, Rebecca's starting... They were going to leave me, weren't they? Jane didn't mean what she said. I think she gets scared, too, about what might happen. How come... You didn't leave me. Because we're friends. I could never be that good of a friend. I just want my dad. I know. When he... When he gets here, we should all go back to the cabin. We're safe there. He's dead. You saw it happen. You need to face that. Sarah? Hey. I think that's all she can take for now. She'll be all right. Jane? Hey, Clementine, up here. Oh, hey. Museum was a bust, huh? We found water. A lot of it. Well, that's something, at least. Check this out. This gate's still locked. Which means that, hopefully, no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. 
I've been trying to get it open, but it's locked pretty tight. That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand at this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Find anything? No, not even trash. There were more cannons in the museum. Mike said they're just for show. They fill them with cement, so they're safe. Oh. Ow! Shit! You okay? Yeah. I think I almost had it. Keep looking. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind, though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. Can we fight him? Could be too risky. I didn't get a good look at him. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. I'll distract him so you can sneak up behind him. Good call. Shit. Hide now. Hey. I just want to talk to you. Do you understand me? Yes. I am Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns! Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no! Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please! If that medicine's for your sister, why are you hiding it in the garbage? I, uh... I need to keep it... I need to keep it safe. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No! You are not nice people! You have already left me defenseless, and now you... You take my sister's medicine? You are worried. Hey! We've got people who are suffering. Who need this medicine? Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it! Clementine, we need people that stuff! People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special! Thank you. 
You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Bush. Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. <laughs> oh, what are you doing? You don't have to do this. Jane, don't do it. Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. Can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? We should go get everyone else. Yeah. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place open. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. Clem! Clem, hey! Any luck with that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from me in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. The deck might be a safe place we can stay tonight, where Rebecca could have the baby. At least, if we can't find something better. I guess that's something. I should check it out. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah. She's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I like her. She's honest, and she knows what she's doing. Yep. That's more than I can say for some. Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just... he seems broken. And broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. You're wrong. Kenny's stronger than anyone. He tries to protect us. I don't know, Clem. I know he's your friend and all. But what Kenny did to Carver, it sounded like he beat right through the corpse and into the floor. Is that where we are now? Carver deserved what happened to him. He was a bad man. No question about that. I'm just hoping we don't become the same. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh, I'll see you back there. Told you. Okay, 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 okay. Oh God. Oh God. Oh no. Oh. Stop. Stop. Oh. Clem. Clementine. Oh. Shit. Walkers. How they get that close without anyone seeing them? That was Luke. Kenny, we've got to do something. You just keep that baby safe. Kenny, we can't stay here. The museum. It's our only choice. No, Jane and I found a place. I'll show you. Good. Someone help me up. Mike, the water. On it. Jesus. 
Yes. Clem, I, I don't think he's okay. He's losing it. I mean, that... that isn't... He's doing it to protect us. Sure, but... Kenny! as human as I've felt in a long time. I almost forgot what... Clementine! G Jesus, Clem, it's just not... Uh, What's going on? Well, uh... I mean... In here. Let's get you comfortable. What the fuck are you two doing up here? Kenny! What's going on? We got God knows how many walkers out there, which you were supposed to be keeping an eye out for. Hey, hold on a second. Just tell me what's going on. Going on is you're a reckless fucking moron. Rebecca's having the baby. Now? No! Fuck. I'm sorry. Shit. Right Shit. over here. Uh. They're coming up the stairs. Here. Uh, we should. You want to help? Get out there and keep the walkers off us. I'll do this. I've been here before. They can't rush us on the stairs. Shoot them before they get to us. I'm going outside. I'll help hold them back. Go. I've got Rebecca. Here they come! Here, we can't let them up here. There are too many of them. Shit! Keep shooting! They are not getting up here! Something to block this gate! Help us! We could block the gate with this! I'll help, I'm coming. Clementine! 
Move it! Come on! I'm going as fast as I can. Watch it! Son of a bitch! Hey, Clementine. Hey. How's he doing? He's perfect. Who's a perfect little man? He looks like Alvin. You think so? Definitely. Thank you. <coughs> I'm fine, I'm fine. I just wish I could get warm. Clem, why don't you give her that coat we found? Sorry, you know, about the color. You really think I care about that? Do you want to hold him? Could I? Of course. Your family. Here. should rest especially you when's the last time you slept Kenny oh, about two years ago I'm fine plus somebody's got to watch you while mama gets your beauty sleep you never forget that smell Listen, I'm sorry. I've got to go. What about Luke? What about him? Aren't you guys... Look, Luke's a nice guy, but it's not like that. And it can't ever be like that. Oh. Well, that's it then. You know, Jamie, Sarah... I'm not gonna stick around and watch it happen to you two. You know the score. I'm not like them. No. But give it enough time, and everyone's luck runs out. Listen, when the shit hits the fan, because it always does, remember that you can make it on your own. It's not an option for everyone. If things start heading south, don't let them drag you down with them. You don't owe them anything. They'll make you feel like you do. I owe these people everything. They've kept me safe, looked out for me. I wouldn't be here without them. Well, they can't keep you safe forever. No one is safe forever. You take care of yourself. I mean that. Here. Thanks. Yeah. I, um... Uh, I gotta go.
Hey, thought you'd be asleep by now. You okay? No. I guess we all got stuff on our minds. <sighs> the temperature's dropping. We're low on food. I think we gotta stay put for a while. You know, for Rebecca and the baby. So I'm thinking as soon as it gets light, Jane and I should go explore. See if we can find some place to scavenge. What? Jane left. For good. What? When? Just now. Are you serious? She didn't say anything about leaving to me? What the fuck? Damn it! Hey, keep it down. Sorry. I... Sorry. Just... Jane's gone. Really? Luke? Of all the childish bullshit... Childish? God damn it, Kenny. You know what? Just... Lay off! No, you put our lives, this baby's life at risk, so you two could roll around like fucking teenagers! Look, I made a mistake, alright? You guys are both acting like jerks. All you guys do is fight. Look, I'm sorry, okay? I fucked up. But you know what, Jane? She made an offer, and Jesus Christ, I needed it, okay? I mean, look around you, okay? Everything is shit! So forgive me for wanting to enjoy one moment of something else! Fine, but this baby, he's what matters now, got it? So get your shit Jenny, together. Where's my baby? Is everything all right? Everything is fine. We're gonna need a good place to raise him, which ain't here. We gotta push on. We head north, get to Wellington. That's our best shot. There's a town across the river. It might be safe there. Or at least it might be a good stop on the way. Kenny! I'm sorry. Clem's got a point. That could be a whole town full of supplies, and not that far from here. Whole lot better than here, anyway. Looks like that's our best bet. We need to get on the road as soon as possible. We leave at first light. Whoa, whoa! What are you talking about? <laughs> Rebecca needs rest. A few days, at the least. We've got that baby formula. And it won't help the rest of us. Now what about shelter? We'll freeze out here. Kenny's right. We should leave in the morning. Rebecca is not in any condition to travel. I'll be fine. If there's a chance there's food, we have to risk it. <sighs> okay, fine, if that's what you want. Look, we should all try to get some sleep. It's been a long day. She's exhausted. We all are. I can keep going. We should have stayed put. We should have stayed put until she was in better shape. She wasn't gonna get no better back there. We gotta find food. Get her someplace warm. This looked like someplace warm to you? We can still turn back. That's not an option. Everybody hang in there. We gotta keep moving if we're gonna make it to that town before nightfall. You don't even listen to anyone else. You just go on barking orders. You gotta lighten up, okay? You're pushing them too hard. I'm just doing what has to be done, like always. Luke's right. Everyone's tired. I know they are, but waiting's only gonna make things worse. You agreed with me on that last night. Uh, uh, oh. Oh, here. 
It's a place to sit. Rebecca, let me take the baby. Oh, he's okay. I've got him. No, you rest for a minute. I'll wash him. Back off, Kenny. She said she doesn't want you to take the baby. Don't be weird about it, okay? I ain't Shh. being weird about it. Yeah, you kinda have been. Kenny knows what he's doing. He's been a dad before. That's not the part I was concerned about. Hello? What is this? Minas Lishna! Arvo? Arvo? Jane and I met him on the observation deck. Before everyone else came. You know this son of a bitch? Well, what's he want? He doesn't look like much. That ain't the point. He has a sick sister. They might be in trouble. Huh. All right. Hello. Your name is Clementine. Yes? Hi, Arvo. These are your friends? I'm hoping you can help me now, not like before. All of you can help. I'm sorry about before. Yes. I need, uh, uh, things for bandages. I need bandages. Are you hurt? No. Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Nikaki Aruji! Fuck! Это они? Да. Это они. <laughs> Скажи им, чтобы они поставили их оружие на пол, и что вы забираем все, что они имеют. Что ты хочешь, чтобы я взял? Откуда я знаю? What's so funny? Why did they laugh? I told them you are the ones who robbed me. They think it's funny that you're just a little girl. Robbed? And they want you and your friends to put down the guns, so we can take your things. Whoa, whoa, hang on now. What the hell? Why get excited? It wasn't me who took your stuff. It was Jane. It, it wasn't any of us. Jane? Where's the other woman? What happened? I do not see a woman who was with you. She's gone. She left the group. It's a trap. I know it. Они прячутся. Я знаю, что они прячутся. Hey, hey, hey. This can be easy for you. Arvo, скажи, чтобы они опустили оружие. All of you, just put your guns down. This will be fine. We have a baby! You have a baby with you? У них родничковый ребенок! Если ты знаешь, что хорошо для тебя, опусти оружие сейчас! Не слишком много! Бурико, отойди! Drop that now or I'm gonna fucking shoot it! I'll do it! No. Drop it! Drop it! Don't fucking... Don't move! I said don't move! Everybody, 